This video will show you how to turn a bicycle speedometer into a cadence meter. Cadence is important because it shows you how fast you are pedaling. Any bicycle speedometer will work, but I'm cheap, so I like using Swin Cycle computers. I buy them at Walmart for $10. The spoke magnet that comes in the kit will not work. You will need a magnet to mount on the pedal crank arm. I found these at Radio Shack. You can also use a magnet from a magnetic switch or stack magnets. The only hard part is to determine where to mount the magnet and the speedometer sensor. Here are two possible configurations. The one with a switch magnet looks better, or one with a stack of magnets. The only requirement is that the magnet must go near enough to the sensor to count each revolution of the crank. The next step is to program the speedometer. The magic number is 88 because if I turned a wheel 88 feet in circumference at 60 RPM, it would travel 60 miles per hour. To program the cycle computer, I need to convert 88 feet into millimeters. The problem is that I can only put four digits into the speedometer, so I move the decimal point over one place. Use 2682 as the wheel circumference to program the Swin cycle computer. Be sure to use the miles per hour mode. When paddling, the speedometer attached to your crank will read 7.5 when you are paddling 75 RPM. One advantage of shifting the decimal point is that we can read RPMs higher than 99. The cadence speedometer will also record my average RPM and my maximum RPM. Well, that's all there is to it. Have fun.